It's a, oh, it's the same player as last time. Okay. We must be the only two up. <laughs> be looking for a bit of redemption so I don't want to sit back too much though because in that last game we were sat back like anything and did not like that opening one bit it, nothing was being generated Still moving fast though, so they've not picked up on that area of concern, so that's good for us. Maybe they have done. Now they're taking the time. It's my go. <laughs> I'm sat here staring at the board. It's my go. <laughs> oh my! How many times have I done that? Oh dear me. Uh, I've just got up, so um, that's my excuse. <laughs> oh dear me! But I have had coffee, so <laughs> it should be a bit more alert. Oh dear, that was so funny. Uh, let's see what we got. I don't really like my dark square bishop just sat there doing nothing. Let's just bring it off. Right, wake up. So he's come down attacking the pawn here. He's got his knight under attack. I think that knight should have taken our knight. Let's just go with this. He's gone back to speedy mode again. So we might as well take here because we like to obliterate the centre if we can. He's going crazy. He's turned it into like a massive take fest. One of the annoying things in um, past OTB games where I saw it more often was, you know, they didn't take, they'd bring the knight here. And I feel that it's probably a comfortable position for it because it doesn't have a pawn that can come down here. So we could go with the arty, but it is arty, isn't it? The mantra goes, simple direct moves to remove pieces from the board strategically. This looks like a little bit of a dance. Is there a problem with us actually capturing the knight? Not really, the bishop takes, the bishop's out. So I'm going to keep it as simple, I'm not going to do the dance. Probably are supposed to do the dance, but yeah. Not when it's just a simple capture and their bishops out in the out in the air. Because now we can attack it. And it's moved away from protecting his king, which is a bit dangerous. Maybe we can squeeze in here. Obviously, this pawn is going to drop to block all that. But then we've got this tip capture here with a check on the king. Small potatoes. Does, does actually drop as well so I think we stick with the plan little capture here with the check on the king 
So they're still moving dead quick like um, they're meant to do these things. We can double up on the bishop here, nothing else can actually protect. Have to be mindful, might come with this dirty tactic thing here. So if we do bring a rook to support. If we bring a rook to support, then at least if they do do that, we can take the bishop off the board and feel happy that our queen isn't getting taken for free. That's probably why they've gone slow now because that's what they were planning potentially. You can always go back, protect the queen. Yep, so they have gone for that, which I, I feel is a little bit of a waste, really. And they did actually take their time, because now we can basically just take the bishop. He's looking to save his queen as well. I think there's a lot of tempo lost by these manoeuvres that they've just done. There will be pressure put on this pawn. If we just push here, attacking the queen again. So we do have the bishop, he's got his rook defending at the moment. And, oh. Let's come for another one. Okay. That was quick. Let's um, jump in here. Do, 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 do. He's trying to turn it into a bullet match, you know, or moving real quick. And that's one one thing I've learned throughout the years. Try and work with the time scales that you've been put on. Because then you're not gonna fall foul of anything. Got a bit more time to think. I mean, 10 minutes is still quick. But it doesn't look like this player's kind of learning from the, that moving quick aspect. Which is kind of annoying because they probably would be... Well... Hmm... <laughs> Oops, excuse me, here are me, fingers going funny. Way too fast. It doesn't impress me moving fast, especially if you're not finding good position. Spending all this time with that pawn, these pieces could be developed. Not that I want them to do that, so this is how we're hopefully trying to take advantage of what's happening on the board.